What's up? What's going on, everybody? I hope everybody's having a great night, great day, depending on where you guys are at in the world. I'm going to talk to you guys about Chainlink today. Massive utility rolled out the other day, as some of you guys may be aware. But I want to talk about today how this massive utility actually is going to lead Chainlink into um, where they where they want to go into the future and how this massive utility plays into that. So let's go ahead. Let's get it right. Let's get right in. Let's get right in after it, guys. So we're over here, guys. We're on a coin um, coin desk article about Chainlink and them guys rolling out a app called the Transporter, guys. The Transporter is a bridge amongst all the blockchains, which allows you to utilize your black utilize your tokens across all blockchains, right? So huge, huge, massive utility. This is a Chainlink development, guys. This isn't a third party development. It's not something that somebody else developed that they're rolling out on um on the chain links um blockchain although x x the um the one that we covered the other day um you know it, it is great it's a third party application but you know this is actually chain links invention this is their transporter this is what they're going to do this allows um cryptocurrencies to be bridged from blockchain to blockchain to blockchain to blockchain right which is absolutely massive absolutely where we got to go especially big institutional investments like banks institutions real world assets they need to be able to move things from private blockchains to public blockchains from ethereum to bnb to to arbitron or you know base or wherever you have to move them they have to be able to move their money around right and especially from private to public blockchains this is a must this is what transporter does for them guys so yes transporter was built um kind of for the retail investor they allow us to use it but this is really all about institutional investment right so this is a massive utility that's rolled out think about how easy it's going to be like let's say you're trading on base right from a retail investor standpoint you're trading on base and you have wrapped base ethereum and you needed to get back to regular ethereum you just send it through the transporter right Boom and boom, you're done. You're done in seconds, right? It happens that fast. But more importantly, I need to bring you guys back to what Chainlink talked about a while ago. And that was having a single use gas token, right? And um, this is where I think Transporter is going to really, really start to set itself apart from a lot of other bridges, right? So Chainlink talked about the single use gas token a long time ago, a couple months ago while ago seems like forever ago in crypto but they talked about it and nobody knew exactly how we were going to roll out this single use gas token for Chainlink. how this thing was going to roll out how it was going to work what was going to happen but we just knew that it was going to happen why did we know it was going to happen because the developers told us it was going to happen and everything that they say that they're going to do they've done well i think we just found out how this is going to happen it's going to happen through transporter right so obviously right now everything is paired with ethereum right or bnb or you know base or whatever right imagine everything being paired with chainlink right and chainlink being used as that single bridge currency right across all of these blockchains even the, the private blockchains right so big institutional investors happen to buy chainlink to utilize this trans transporter and to maneuver through the chainlink blockchain I think that this is how Chainlink gets to that single use gas token, right? I think the proof is right here. I think we kind of roll it out the way that it is. And then you roll in that single use gas token here um, after a while. And I think that's how we get here, guys. That is the big development for me, right? I love Transporter, right? I think it's a major, major development. But I love to see what's next. And I've always been interested in how that single use gas token was going to take, was going to roll out. I think it's going to roll out right here. I think this is how we're going to see it roll out. I think they had to roll out the bridge first and then the single use gas token later. What's that going to do for Chainlink, guys? That means every transaction that happens on the Chainlink blockchain 
will utilize the chain link token, right? And when that happens, you're going to see massive volume. You're going to see a massive uptick in, in volume. And you're going to see a massive uptick in price as well, which is why I think Chainlink, you're sitting at a three dollars $400 price point at the height of the bull run if we can get to a single-use gas token before then, right? Which I think we can. I think we're right there. I think the team knows how they're going to do it. I think they're going to roll it out. So, um I just think that the transporter is step one in that process, right? And that that's this is just Danny talking, right? Like I don't have any proof, not behind the scenes. I'm not talking to the team. It's just me thinking out loud and me thinking about how this thing's gonna roll out. So let me know what you guys think. Is this the first step to that single use gas token? And will we ever get to the single use gas token? Do you guys believe that we'll ever get there? Drop me a comment below. Let me know. Let me know what you guys think. Go ahead, guys. Give this video a like. Give this video a share. If you like this content, go ahead. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification. Get notified of all the videos that we put out when we put them out, guys. So with that, I'm going to leave you guys with that. Um, but yeah, big chain link news, big chain link updates, transporters out. But always thinking about that next step. How do we get to that single use gas token? I think we're almost there, guys. So with that, you guys have a great day. Thank you guys for stopping by to watch the video. I appreciate every single one of you guys. And you guys have a phenomenal day. And we will get at you guys on the next one.